today I have got the River Island Avon Calendar to unbox for you guys. I'm very excited about this, very excited. This Avon Calendar cost £79. I did end up creating a new River Island account so I could get, I think it was 10% off. So I got some, I got a little bit of a discount on this for myself. Um, yeah, so if you wanted to do that, I suppose you could do that. Uh, but this Avon Calendar costs £79, so I will unbox it from the £79 point value in my mind. I'm very excited about this. Um, I love River Island as a brand. If you don't know, I have had a lot of River Island bags over the years, things like that. But when I was looking at it, I thought that seems very pricey. And I will say it, it's very pretty to look at. But for River Island brand, I feel like it's pricey, so it's got to be good. You know what I mean? So we're going to unbox it in anyways, and let's just see what this is. Well, I'm the £79 pound point this week, so a £3.29, pence, I think it said. I asked Alexa. Um, yeah, so it's around £3 something a day. So they have to be decent-ish days, really, to be honest. But I'm quite excited. It's quite largely spread out. But I do like the design. I like the design of the outside. I like the design of the inside. It's very simple. But we're just going to unbox it. So it's day number one, which is right here. It's a box design, which is really nice. I like this type of design. So, day number one is... Oh, it is a pair of Kiss Gel Fantasy Nails. They're really pretty. This is what they look like. I'm a pointy girl at heart, but I would definitely wear these. Let's see the length, actually. Yeah, they seem all right, to be honest. I would definitely wear these, though. These are so, so pretty. Yeah, and they don't look like a horrible design. And I think these are like six or seven pounds, the Kiss ones. So you're definitely getting your money's worth there. So day number two is here. Oh, it's quite heavy. Let's have a look. What are you? We have got Paradox Volume Blow Dry Spray. Um, that's nice to see something different from Paradox. I absolutely love their conditioning mask. It says here, yeah, it's the ultimate blow dry volumizing primer. Expect instant roof lift with thicker, fuller, healthy looking hair and faster blow dry. That sounds amazing. So I'm very, very excited about that. A full size too. So we're getting like good sizes. So day number three, it's this one here. Yeah. Feels very light. Right, we've got a pair of lashes. These are the Demi Lashes from Prima. We have literally just gotten a pair of these and one of the advent calendars, but this is like full size lashes. They don't come with glue, but they're really quite pretty. And if you're into lashes, they are nice. Day number four, which is this one here. Oh, feels very heavy. We have got a Lemina Rockaroon Moisturizing Hair, Moisturizing Hair, Moisturizing Hand and Nail Cream. Love the packaging, love, love, love. Lee, Macar Lee Mini Macaroon is one of them brands that, you know, is so cute and dinky. It's sealed, so I'm going to leave it like that. It's in a cherry scent. So that is cute. I would like to, I'm going to, I think I'd like to try that, to be honest, but we'll see. I'm very nervous about scented hand creams at the minute because of my hands. So lately I've been sticking to like Loctane for my hand creams. So that's day number four. So do you know our five, which is this one? Yeah. Very, very light. And we have got, yeah, I don't like this day at all. This is some face and body jewels. These definitely don't cost three pounds a month, do they? You can buy them. Re this is the In You Dreams brand. Yeah, these aren't something that I use. If they were nail gems, I would have used them straight away, but yeah. I suppose River Island is more aimed at younger people, I think, and people have been doing the eye looks with that sort of crystals and stuff, but yeah, I didn't like that day. That's day number five, so we've had our first stud day, in my opinion. Um, day number six is massive. Look at the size of this. Absolutely massive. Right, let's have a look. Wow, we've got a wet brush. We have got... A full size wet brush. I am actually over the moon with this. Yes, very much so. Like, really, really, really over the moon with that. I love wet brushes. Fab. Day number six. So we went to day number seven. 
which is down here. Oh, they all fell. <laughs> right, let's have a look. We've got two small sizes. So these are like, these are on the feel you need pick and mix, or they were. This is the Cetaphil Gentle Skin Cleanser and the Moisturising Lotion. I like that you're getting both of them. They're still little dinky sizes, but because you're getting both of them, I feel like you're getting your money's worth. So it's not so bad. If you got one, I would have been like, hmm. But no, I quite like that day. I think that's a decent-ish day. So, yeah, we have getting two. Oh, my God, if I could keep a hold of them. We have getting two Cetaphil little minis. I like that day. Yeah, I like that day. That was day number seven. We went day number eight. This one here. Yeah. You know I love to shake it. <laughs> we have got, if I could get out, an Ico mascara, is it? A black magic mascara. I like that. It's not an eyeliner. I feel like we get so many Ico eyeliners. Um, it is the Black Magic Mascara. I'm not going to open it. Wow, this tube's massive though. <laughs> like, absolutely massive. I'm not going to open it. I'll put a picture of what the one looks like. I've got so many mascaras open. But I know my friend Bryony loves the Ico Mascara. She swears by them. I think it's her favourite mascara. I'm positive that's what she said. So, yeah. The packaging feels lovely. So, excited about that. Because I don't think I've tried it for a while. So, I can't remember what I think of it. But you guys know I love mascara. Um, so that's day number eight. We want day number nine, which is this one here. We have got some from Bye Bye. Oh, I think that's how you say it. Bye Bye. This is the Eye Plump Bactual Eye Cream. So it says rich overnight eye treatment with factual hyaluronic acid and broccoli seed oil to plump, firm, and hydrate the delicate eye eye area. Oh, my eyes are looking all lately. I am so tired and so my eyes just look drained. So yeah, I, I might give that like I'm gonna get I'm gonna give that a go and see if that makes a difference. I'm very excited about that. It's day number nine. We went day number ten. Up in this corner here. It's quite hefty. We have got Oh, a Shea and Blue perfume. It is the Blood Orange one. I have got, got one of the Shea and Blue perfumes in the Marks and Spencer's Avant Candle last year. It is a beautiful. I don't think it was this one. Um, let's have a smell. You just know I love a perfume. Very excited. That smells like straight up oranges. That is unreal. If you love orange scents, wow. That is such a summer fragrance. That's beautiful, absolutely beautiful, so different. Yeah, I love that day, absolutely love that day. You know I love perfume, but that is so different. Wow, that's beautiful, that is absolutely beautiful. That was day number 10, we went day number 11. Can you guys see it? Um. Oh, it's here, so it's a long and skinny one. We have got, let's have a look, see. We have got a, Spectrum brush, you guys know I love a spectrum brush. This is the A17, it's like an angled brush. I don't know if it's for eyeliner or eyebrows, but I like that brush. I've most likely got this brush. I have got so many spectrum brushes, it's unreal. But yeah, I love a spectrum brush. And spectrum brushes, this is like their core line, the pink and blue line. I think range from £5 onwards, so that's a good day. 1 to 12, this one here, oh this is hefty, we have got the curl jelly scrunching jelly for scrunching drying all types of curls, teens, frizz, edge shines and divines, defines, you guys you know I've got naturally curly hair, well I have not got naturally curly hair, I've got na like a natural dodgy wave, it's not quite a curl, it's like a wave, and I always like to wear it natural. I always get complimented when I wear it natural. But it's just I never really like the way it looks when it's natural. So I feel like this is something that I would definitely use. But then if you had straight hair. But it says perfect product for scrunch dry and banish frizz and adds shines with no crunchy feel. Adds definitions to waves and curls formulated without silicones. I feel like if you've done the 
diffuse that drying when you had straight hair and use this it might give you like a wave effect so i feel like it could be used for more than just curly haired people but i think it's preference so we went day number 13 it's light as a feather what are you it is a cognac sponge it's the cognac sponge brand like actually the brand is cognac sponge i really like a cognac sponge actually they're like a hard sponge and they soften in the water this is in the shape of a heart oh i love that love that yeah love that that was day number 13. day number 14 is a little one here yeah. so i'm guessing like a little nail polish because it's so small it doesn't feel like nail polish to be honest right we have got a doctor lip nipple balm it is just a little ditty size for dry skin luscious lips and glossy bits <laughs> i've got this this is a really nice product i got this last year it's quite a small size but it's not too bad and considering majority every day apart from them gems has been a good day i'm not complaining so that was day number 14 we want day number 15 which is this one here what oh, hefty hefty we have got something from main body and um, main tan body and skin this is the luminate and facial tan mist oh i love luminate i love a facial tan mist i love just spritzing these i've not tried this one i normally use the same repairs i'm quite bougie with the facial tan mists um yeah but i'm excited about trying this it says it's infused with rose water very excited about that so we want day number 16, which is a big square box here. This is it here. Oh, this is a big product. This is the Sheer Glow Transfers and Glaze Clear Conditioning Gloss. If you don't know what glaze products are, I would have been normally mourning that we didn't get a shampoo, but glaze products are, you can get them in tones as well, like brunettes and stuff like that. And I watched a girl do a review on these. Um, it puts like a sheer shine it enhances your natural color beautiful but you can get them in tones of like brunettes blondes things like that but this is the sheer one so i i'm not complaining that we're not getting a con shampoo with it because i know this is like the type of product it puts like a gloss on you so yeah i'm very very excited about that it says color boost mirror glaze shine extra, extra extraordinary softness no damage no mix no mess semi-permanent lasts up to 10 washes and then this shows you what it does I'm going to look to see if they do have a shampoo because I think I would purchase a shampoo but I don't think they do. That's why I'm not complaining but I could be wrong. But I'm still excited about it either way. So that's day number 16. We're in day number 17 which is this one here. Here's a very light, very light. We have got the Arula London. You know this is such a nice brand try quite a few things from this brand and people don't talk about it enough this is the balance and purifying citrus cleanser this is a uk brand i think oh it's got a seal on let's have a smell though oh it smells so nice i think i've had this actual cleanser before to be honest and it was nice like the smell scent is just brought back memories but this is such a nice brand it's quite a bougie brand and all so i'm very excited about that and it's day number 17 we're coming to an end that was day number 18 17 sorry so we want day number 18 clearly missed a day and this wouldn't be the first time i've ever missed a day um right let's have a look what are you we have got a beauty pro i love beauty pro this is a retinol anti-aging overnight serum i'm very excited about this i need retinol in my life i do i'm at that age it says let's have a look this overnight serum is the perfect combination to your favorite beauty pro daytime serum it's got sea kelp in it's a naturally derived ocean retinol from seaweed providing skin conditional benefits it's got organic organic pain up pain oil in this powerful ingredient calms and detoxifies it's got wild yam and provides re rehydration to dry and dehydrated skin vegan friendly 100% plant based I'm very excited about that I need a bit of this sort of stuff in my skincare and I do really like beauty pros so it's like a brand I trust so that was 18 we want 19 it's a little square here so I'm guessing a lip balm <laughs> this is my guess and it is not what are you it is a wet liner and this is from 
the Glisten brand. This is in a very, very blue product. Um, it's a very blue shade. I would never wear this. I would never wear this. I really would like to try wet liners, but I know myself and I know I would never wear this. And I've heard really good things about these. But if it, if it was a different colour, I would have been buzzing, but blue is just a bit too out there for me. <laughs> but I think that's the whole point of them products. Do you know what I mean? That was day 19. We went day 20, which is this one here. <clears throat> this is a mud masky brand and it is a vitamin A boost blue clay mask. I've got this. This is such a beautiful product. This is bigger than the one I've got. I think I've got a 30ml. This is a 60ml. Really, really nice product. Mud masky products are really nice to be honest. So yeah, I'm happy with that. T20. We want day 21, which is this one here. And we have got a makeup product. It is Bella Pierre and this is the Pro Blush Quad Palette. I love Bella Pierre as a brand. I think it's very underrated. And this is what it looks like here. Oh, I love this shade here. This is beautiful. These could be used very naturally. They could be used as highlighters as well if you were a bit of a darker skin tone. Very, very, very nice. Yeah, that's a nice product to get. I like Bella Pierre as well. So that's day number 21. We want day number 22, which is this little one up here. We have got a Revolution lipstick in the shade of Boss, and it is a black lipstick. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to give this to Kieran for one of his friends. I'm going to get it open though for you. And show you use it. What a what is the packaging stunning? Yeah, this is a black lipstick. That is not for me. <laughs> My lipstick's quite dark today, but it's not black. I'm gonna give that to Kieran for one of his friends because Kieran is um, a little bit uh, like goffy, and his friends are the same. So I think one of his friends might have a use for that. So it's not always. Twenty three is this one he has the day before the last day. And we have got, ooh, ooh, we have got a River Island perfume. You guys know I love a perfume. We've already had one perfume. They're treating us to two perfumes. So this is, so this is the amber and vanilla scent. They did not want us to get into this. I tell you that for sure. Um, let's have a look. That is so vanilla-y. If you like vanilla fragrances, you will like that. That is definitely not for me. I'm good about that though a little bit because I love fragrance but I just can't stand you know a lot of the fragrances I like have vanilla in but that is like that is a full-on like straight up vanilla fragrance which is in the name I can't get it back together it was so hard to open but such a nice product to get if you love vanilla so fragrance. last day day number 24 if I can it feels light we have got the aroma active sleep soap we got these in the pretty little thing advent calendar smell amazing but for the last day christmas eve day before my birthday i feel like they're a little bit of a letdown but overall to be honest like I'm okay so that is the river island advent calendar unbox and you know what even for full price i got mine a little bit discounted but i was working out full price i am impressed majority majority of the items were full size it was like a couple that were small they were all good brands majority the only thing i see really let that down was the gems i'm impressed like i am really impressed i <laughs> like if this is a good contender for one that I, I would keep to unbox through the month of December. I always keep one to unbox through the month of December. Normally, well, I always keep two. Normally, it's the Ted Baker and the next one. But this year, this one is a real good contender to be one that I unbox through the month of December. I like it that much. I am so impressed with it. I feel like it's definitely worth it. It's got different products in. A lot of beauty 
Avencana brands have the same stuff in and I am including Glossy Box and look fantastic in that. They are always fab for their money but you see a lot of the same stuff and I feel like this had a di different, like different stuff and I'm really impressed with it. Um, I definitely feel like it could have been about £10 cheaper but even at the price point it is, I think it's fab but if it does go down in price I would snatch it up. It is so good, but even at its full price, I think it's worth it. In my opinion, I really liked it. It definitely worked for me. It had false nails in. I love stuff like that. It had hand cream in, but just one. Love this. Absolutely love this. So yeah, I'm so, so happy with this. Um, I've been kind of, I hope you enjoyed this video. And anyways, if you like these type of videos, I would love if you subscribe down below. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.